you cannot connect the dots going forward. You have to connect the dots going backward and have faith in something. Karma, religion, your own capacities. That's what Steve Jobs said. You cannot connect the dots going forward. And so we look back, we gather these dots, we go looking for these dots and see how they might come together to form a story. And Steve, when he was thinking back upon his own life, had a reflection. When he was 12 years old, he came upon a magazine article in Scientific American. And it was about the efficiency of the species. Which species was the most efficient? Any ideas? Ant. Oh, the ant. I like it. Bees. Bees thank you. They fly very high. Very close. Condor. The condor. The condor was the most efficient of all the species. And humans, they were pretty back in the middle, which wasn't that impressive for the crown of all creation. But what somebody figured out was to take the human and put that human on a bicycle. And when they did, they found that the human blew away the condor by an order of magnitude in terms of efficiency. And what Steve Jobs realized from this is that humans, as tool building species work to build tools that further what is possible and in fact that a computer is a bicycle for the mind and I think that's immensely powerful but it brings a question to me and the question is this how do we know where to go if the computer is a bicycle for the mind that carries our capacities so far that we could never even imagine, how do we know where to go? And that's where the bicycle for the heart comes in. That's where our stories come in. That's where this rare connection between heart and mind bringing purpose, aligning us with those around us, and aligning us with our deepest capacities. And so, as we connect the dots this evening, as we bring links to stories, I'd like to just pause to honor the stories that you come with, the stories that you bring into the room and the power of purpose and orientation that you've arrived with.